Hello everybody, um, this is James Dawson, the author of Young Adult Thriller Hollow Pike. Um, this is my last vlog of 2012 and I wanted to reflect on what a mad and brilliant year 2012 has been and also to thank everybody who has been involved in making this year as successful as it has been. Um, yeah, 2010 and 2011 was so much about trying to get Hollow Pike published that you sort of didn't really think, or I didn't really think, about what would happen once it actually was published. Um, my goal was so focused on getting that book onto the shelves that I didn't really think about it. And it turns out that <laughs> it's really, really mad when you have a book out and it's been the busiest, funnest year and there's loads and loads of people that I would like to thank in that. I've actually made a list in my ideas book, which I believe one day will be worth literally tens of pounds on eBay, as it's full of all of my amazing ideas. Um, yeah, so I suppose let's start at the beginning. I would like to thank everybody at Ryan, who has worked really, really super hard to give Hollow Pike such a big splash, and it, you know, it's done well. Um, so big, big thank you to my editor Amber, and particularly the fantastic Nina Douglas, who um, has accompanied me on many, many train journeys and fed me crisps. Thank you. Um, also my agent Jo, who continues to be the most fantastic support that an author could have. That's Jo Williamson from Anthony Harwood. Thank you. She's not really on the internet, so she's probably not seeing this. Brilliant. Um, some big, big thanks to booksellers as well um, that have really, really helped sort of hand sell Hollow Pike. I've learned this year that unless you're Pippa Middleton, um, there is no reason why anybody should care about some former teacher from South London, so um, originally Bradford. So um, it's been fantastic that booksellers have sort of in introduced something new to young readers. So that's all the booksellers that have supported Hollow Pike, thank you. But a special thank you to Dean Miguel from Waterstones Croydon, Neil from Foils for all the events, which have been fantastic, and Den Patrick from off of um, Blackwells, um, Silverdale, an amazing independent bookshop up north, Tales of Moon Lane, an amazing independent in London, Clapham Books, another amazing independent. Thank you for all the work you've done to promote me. That's been fantastic. Um, and yeah, and a broader thank you to all the Waterstoneses and all the WH Smith. Um, every time, I still can't go past a Waterstones or WH Smith without sticking my head in to see if Hollow Pike's there, and it always is. So, what more can you ask for? That's amazing. Thank you very much. Um, now, bloggers, you know I love you. You've been amazing. Amazing. Um, like cheerleaders, not just for Hollow Pike, but for all the UKYA authors. It has been fantastic. Um, Hollow Pike could not have had a better christening. Um, for everybody who's read it, for everybody who, who's reviewed it, good or bad, thank you for choosing Hollow Pike over a reread of The Hunger Games. It's amazing. Thank you very, very much. Um, and to all of those people um, who have sent me emails, cards, fan mail, um, every, you know, it, there isn't a day that that hasn't brightened. And yes, keep them coming. It's brilliant. Um, it's what you're doing it for. And similarly, a big, big thank you, not just to the bloggers, the readers, but also thank you to all the authors as well. Um, I think we all are supporting each other and especially within the UKY community there's a fantastic sense not of competition but of everybody helping to spread the word of all the different books we're doing and between you and me you know, we're doing some brilliant books some of the best in the world and you know looking at the upcoming 2013 releases I can't wait I can't wait for some of those UKY books to come along so thank you very much to my new writer friends you know who you are I would list you by name because that's weird um, schools, all the schools I've been to, it feels like I've never been out of schools, which is fantastic. Um, it's the highlight of any week because I get out of the flat, I get to see loads of young people and generally talk about the human centipede, which keeps coming up. Happy to talk about it, that's fine, but it's a bit weird. Um, especially, especially to my writing group at Lambeth Academy, with which is with First Story. Um, what a talented, talented bunch of writers you are. I hope you're seeing this. Um, thank you to the Queen of Teen, for the organisers of the Queen of Teen, for that fantastic, fantastic day in July where I got to dress up and be a proper queen. 
Not a word for a day. Thank you. Last of all, actually penultimate, um, the librarians. Um, I've gotten to meet some of you, particularly if you're, if you're school librarians like Joe or Matt. Hello. Um, you've done a great job, again, of getting readers who've never heard of me, never heard of Holler Pike, to pick it up. So that's amazing. Again, thank you. And the last, the last thank you is to just everyone who's read it. Um, you know, you didn't have to, um, and yet a lot of people have, so that's fantastic. Um, keep spreading the word. Um, and I suppose Merry Christmas, festive period, solstice, the Jewish Hanukkahs. Um, I can't wait to see you all next year. Um, a couple more surprises, some stuff I still haven't announced yet, so keep watching. Um, Cruel Summer, August 1st, 2013. Um, in the new year, I shall publish an extract for you to enjoy. Um, but I've got to go, because today I'm going to be typing the actual, the final words of Cruel Summer before it goes off to my editor forever. So, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, see you the other side. Bye.